Are you guys ready for some news? Skip it up and that up. What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Rich of Review Tech USA, and I have more bad news about the Wii U. I don't know what to tell you. When there's good news, like I reported yesterday, there's good news. When there's bad news, there's bad news. Actually, there is a little bit more good news. Um, a bunch of subscribers of mine have sent me links and articles saying that the Wii U actually sold more uh, than VG Charts listed. I think it's actually at 3.06 million globally right now. So, hey, I haven't had time to verify it, so take it with a grain of salt, but a lot of people message me saying the same number, so it has to be true, more than likely. Um, so that's great news, and if I was wrong in, in the wrong direction, that's even better. They sold more than I said. So great, fantastic, that's a good thing. But here's the problem. Uh, Deep Silver, who is now developing uh, Saints Row the Fourth, or Saints Row 4, it's not Saints Row the Fourth, sorry. They're not bringing it to the Wii U. They have no plans of bringing it to Wii U. They, they just said it's not happening, more than likely. Um, Bethesda said they have no plans, but they said that a while back. But this to me was kind of almost a little bit shocking um, because that's you, know, you would think a game like that you'd want them on all platforms, but apparently they don't think the Wii U is a viable platform. And that's a big problem <laughs> because it seems to be happening Nintendo, you need to do something to entice third-party developers because here's there's multiple things going on here. One, the economy sucks, okay? And because of that, people aren't buying every single AAA title out there. Two, you're a new system that's kind of shaky in the States. So a new system has the smallest install base. So when you bring a game, even if it's just a sloppy port over to a new console, it doesn't sell as much. And because of the fact that people are afraid to bring their games over to the Wii U, that means you're not going to get as many third-party titles. So consumers are going to be like, the PS4 is right around the corner. Why would I spend money on the Wii U when I could get you know, the third-party and first-party games from Sony? And same with Microsoft. People may be like, they maybe may have thought about the Wii U because you did promise. You did promise you were going to entice third-party developers more, and now that they're seeing that a bunch of titles, like Crisis 3, I think, was all but confirmed. It was all but complete. It was pretty much complete for the Wii U, and EA said, mm, yeah, our other games didn't sell on the Wii U, so we're not, screw it, Crytek, don't, we're not putting it on the Wii U. You need to do something. You need to cut your licensing fees for like a year. Go to like Deep Silver. Go to Crytek and EA. Go to the rest of the guys who are not making games for, go to Bethesda and say, hey, we'll cut our licensing fees down in half so you could pocket more money for one year. Bring games to our system. Because I'll tell you right now, Nintendo, if you think that this generation's only gonna last five years, you're dead wrong. This could possibly be the last console generation. You may have to, support the Wii U for 10 years. And if you don't have third-party developers to help back you up, you can't just depend on your first-party titles. And I do, I really do. I mean, I have to tell it like it is, but I do want to see the Wii U succeed. You drop the ball on the launch, but you still had a bunch of people worldwide to buy your console, but to keep, to make the momentum start up again, because the momentum has kind of slowed down with the Wii U, to get it move it again, to get it flying off shelves again, people not only have to see first party titles from you, they have to see third party titles knowing they'll get the whole package from the Wii U. And you talked a lot of crap, but now you have to deliver and you have to really embrace and bring in those third party developers and do what you need to do to get big AAA games on your system. This is Rich Review Tech USA, looking sexy as ever, and I'm signing out. Time for me to go to work. Have a good one.